of run four. This is a TVS one make RR310 open race, open category, race two for them. Beautiful Sunday evening, it's 2.53 on the clock. They have a formation lap, eight lap race. Can Arvind, can Anand make a comeback after struggling yesterday? Green flag off and they're off on their formation. A quick look at the grid. A quick look at the grid. In P1, we have number five, Anandar from Chennai. In P2 is Vivek Pillai from Chennai. In P3 is Surya PM. In P4, bike number six, Arun Muthukrishnan. In P5, Anup Kumar. In P6, S. Sivanesan. In P7, number two, Vaishak Sobhan. In P8 is S. Kanan. In P9, number four, Arvind Ganesh. In P10, Kartik Matedi in a bike number 12. In P11, Udipta Kumar Rath. In P12, Ajay Xavier. In P13, number 13, Mahesh Chavan. In P14 is Alameen Merchant. And that's your grid for today. 14 bikes all in all. This is going to be a beautiful, beautiful race. Sometimes you have the gut feeling that when you know that it's going to be a very exciting race. And I have a beautiful, beautiful gut telling me that this will be a very interesting race. Stay tuned, do not go anywhere. Now coming through the midsection of this track, it's a 3.74 kilometer track, that's the Madras Motorsport race track, 12 turns all in all. Sitting in a land of almost 200 acres is uh, at the industrial town of Irangar to Kotai, about 36 kilometers of uh, Chennai. Did you know that the foundation was laid by Margaret Alway, who was then the Minister of uh, Sports? First race in 1990. And this is an FIM and FIA certified track. Fully resurfaced in the year 2017 so they're going to be quite happy while the tarmac is well set right now this track can be used for up to formula 3 races like most of the tracks runs in lights on ladies and gentlemen stay tuned we have a race time Anand R taking a fabulous, fabulous start out there in the front break will I getting left out in the mix there in P3 currently owing to a decent start. He manages to crop up in the P2 at the moment with uh, Surya PM and Arun Muthu Krishnan in hot pursuit. Anup Kumar, number three, somehow getting into the mix there and uh, trying to get ahead of the pack, catching up to the front row. Well, that's Vivek Pillai and Anandar currently fighting it out. They're all in contention for the championship, ladies and gentlemen. Well, championship leader Arvind Ganesh had a tough, tough weekend yesterday. He struggled through to get ahead owing to a bike uh, technical issue on his bike and had to start from the pits. At the moment, he's clocked in the fastest sector one of the 40, 80, almost two seconds faster than the rest of the pack. Arvind needs these points. He struggled yesterday. He needs to get those points if he needs the championship lead. Currently, Vivek Pillai could be edging his stretch closer to the championship title after yesterday's win and uh, Karthik Matedi from Hyderabad who's struggling through this round is third in the championship. Anup Kumar, Surya, PM and Arun Muthu Krishnan are uh, people to watch out for. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the TVS one make RR310 open class. They're riding the race built from the TVS racing factory. The holy grail of the TVS racing industry. Built by hand, track ready and track focused. Currently, Anandar from Chennai, bike number five, in hot pursuit from pole to lead. He looks like he's in good form, the bike seems stable and he's shooting away. That's Surya PM there, being hunted down by what looks to be like Arvind Ganesh himself. Well, that's bike number 11, S. Kanan there, chasing down. Surya PM at the moment, who's gone back right to P5. Currently, 
Coming out is Anandar with the fastest 2-0-0-7-9-7-1-9. With Vivek Pillai in P2 with the 2-0-0-9-6-9. And in P3 is Arun Muthukrish Anup Kumar with the 2-0-0-8-1-9. Arun Muthukrishnan trailing there at the back in P4 with the 2-0-1-1-6-1. A beautiful, beautiful right there. A fight, two-way fight going on between bike number three, Anup Kumar, and bike number six. Uh, Anup, Anup trying to squeeze out everything out from those breaks on the Apache and uh, trying to outbreak Arun Muthukrishnan at the at the moment. Arun seems to be at a very steady hand, not getting shaken up by uh, Anup's dominance and aggression at the moment. Arun's catching up and holding off the line very well at turn 6, turn 7 currently. And uh, maybe it's a wait and, wait and play game. Number 8, S7 is in there on a lonesome piece. 6 at the moment. Gotten ahead of uh, Surya PM. Surya PM at the moment struggling to find the pace that he had yesterday. A little too wide from bike number three. That will cost Anup Kumar his place. Moving. Arun Muthukrishnan is going to have a happy, happy smile at the moment. Well, we've still got quite a few laps. All in all, six laps to go. So it's still anybody's race, ladies and gentlemen. So don't take your eyes off the screen. I am telling you right now. This is turning out to be one of the most exciting races so far. Anandar, oh, that's a lot of, lot of dust flying out from bike number seven. He managed to keep, this is why dirt training is very important, even if you ride only on the, on the circuit. Best of both. Looks like we have the first retirement of the day. That's bike number one, Surya PM, who was qualified in P3, currently pitting in. Unfortunate and disaster. Looks like it's a no-show for him today. Vivek Pillai went a little too hot, couldn't keep the line, got out on the curb there into the straight and what a beautiful save from Mr. Pillai. He's managed to keep P2 but in the moment we have Arun Muthu Krishnan who's in hot pursuit. All of them have entered the 159s but Anandar clocking in yet another fastest with the 158, 397. He's just getting faster and faster. He's picking up the pace and picking up the rest of the crew with him. It's a little too early for tea, but I'm having some tea. Hope you guys get some beverage for yourselves. In fact, I would appreciate it if uh, somebody is having something cold. Drop in your comments. Let me know what you're drinking. If you are. <laughs> At the moment, a very lonesome P1 uh, for uh, Anandar. Owing to Vivek Pillai's little bit of... Uh, Tragic turn 12 attack. At the moment, two way fight. Arno, Arun Muthukrishnan joining in and closing in on number seven at the moment. Vivek Pillai, better watch out. Arun is on charge right now. Both uh, Vivek Pillai and Anup Kumar did make two errors and have uh, lost a bit of uh, momentum there. As bike number 11, S. Uh, Kannan, being uh, chased down by championship leader Arvind Ganesh at the moment. Arvind trying to get into the inside look at uh, turn two. Will he be able to seek it out and get uh, some more points added to his kitty? Currently, Anup Kumar clocking in a very fast 159, 329, trying to make a comeback. Spike number six, Arun Muthu Krishnan, who's currently in P3, trying to catch up to Vivek Pillai. It's still anybody's race, we've got. Roughly around five and a half laps to go. Anandar taking the charge of this race. Yes, Vivek Pillai is very strong to sector one and has managed to clock in a 38.70, the fastest through that sector. If 
you're catching us live and you're just watching the show, this is round four of the MRF MMSE FMSEI Indian National Motorcycle Racing Championship. This is the year 2019. We've done with four rounds. We're finishing with the fourth round. In fact, this is the second last race of today. And uh, we will come to the close of this round. It's been an epic fight and an epic battle of charges between multiple, multiple competitors. A lot of hearts broken, a lot of ecstatic times for these young riders. We see a lot of battle scarred veterans versus young blokes. Anandar on the ride of his life at the moment. What a beautiful line turning into turn one. Looking very smooth and confident throughout this race. Vivek Pillai trying to edge out and get ahead of uh, the rest of the pack. Arun Muthukrishnan, bike number six, trying to catch up but struggling a little bit as uh, Sivanesan has gotten ahead of uh, Arun. And at the moment, Anup Kumar is on the ground. He's taking the charge in this race, it lost out at turn eight, and has managed to come back into the race. He's got a little bit better pace comparatively to Arun at the moment. Could be able to catch up almost 300th of a second difference between the two. Can Anup Kumar get ahead or will Arun Muthukrishnan hold the fort down? Sivanesan at the moment, bike number eight, leading the charge, trying to catch up to Vivek Pillai, who's also on a very good ride. Very beautiful lines from all of them there, keeping it calm, steady and in rhythm. Sivanesan was taken out by Surya PM. He had an unfortunate time. He couldn't get the points that he was looking out for. Three laps to go as a start marshal shows off the three lap flag. Three, three lap to go flag. Oh no, disaster for number eight. He was on such a good ride. Seven Asin, tragic again for number eight, crashing out of the last corner. Unfortunate for Seven Asin. This is good sign for Arvind Ganesh, who's moved into P4 at the moment. Let's take a quick look. He lost his front, couldn't keep it together. The track, the sun has come down a little bit. We've got the sun out, so the temperature is changing drastically. Right now, a two-way fight. We've seen this before. Anup Kumar versus Arun Muthukrishnan. Who's it going to be? Anup Kumar getting a very good line there. Very good drive out and moving ahead of uh, Arun Muthukrishnan. Can Arun Muthukrishnan respond back to that contest and get ahead? That's a bad, bad crash. Has to get back into the garage. Anup Kumar having the right of his life. He was at a 203, 988, and has stepped up the pace. I'm sure he's uh, closing in on a 159 at the moment with Arun Muthukrishnan, Muth who's struggling for pace. We're not really sure he was having such a good ride. Not sure what's up, but uh, he's got a very good lead over Arun Muthukrishnan at the moment. In the front, Ananda still continuing the dominance and the charge on this race. He's gotten ahead, Arun Muthukrishnan trying to outbreak a little bit to catch up to his competition. We have yet again another uh, competitor, number nine, Udipta Kumar, who has uh, gotten into the pits, an early retirement. A lonesome one, two, three currently. Anup Kumar edging slowly away from Arun Muthukrishnan at the moment. He has done an impossible feat. <coughs> in fact, I'm coughing up with excitement that Anup Kumar just clocked in a 154-251. Four seconds of 
even the race leader. Give him a big round of applause. This is Anush Kumar number three on the charge. We're not sure what he just had, but he had something and he brought it all out on the table. Anup Kumar just took a four second difference of the race leader standing at P3. With Arun Muthukrishnan at 200369, who's dropped pace at the moment. Kartik Mateti, they're getting at the inside of Arvind Ganesh, who's the championship leader. Arvind Ganesh has to get ahead if he needs those points. A good two way fight going on between uh, championship leader Arvind Ganesh and uh, Kartik Mateti from Hyderabad, who's uh, slamming this down. This is some incredible second half racing from Anup Kumar. Hopefully the tire holds on to dear life and gets him through the checkered flag. Number seven, a lonesome Vivek Pillai. Anup Kumar, number three. Watch out for this gentleman. He is on fire, ladies and gentlemen. He is setting the track on fire right now. Burning up every bit of rubber on that tire and burning away precious, precious fuel. Currently, we have the first overlap, the blue flag out. Anandar has uh, overlap number 14 there. This is where a blue flag is shown when uh, the front runners have caught up to the back benches of uh, a grid. Informing uh, the overlapped rider to get uh, outside the racing line so that the uh, race can continue on. In the world of racing, the only way to communicate to a racer is uh, through visual communication, so you need flags. Well, if you know how many flags are there totally in uh, racing, in motorcycle and car racing, do drop in your comments. At the moment, this is uh, the last lap of this race. Eight laps, almost done. Anup Kumar flying there. He's dropped down the pace to 158, brought it back to ground reality at the moment. Otherwise, I'm sure he would have burnt those tires down. Anandar with a 159-132 leading this race start to finish. In P2, number seven, Vivek Pillai, who had an earlier scare with a 159-122 on a lonesome P2. Anup Kumar, who also went onto the track, lost a little position to Arun Muthukrishnan, who did have some amount of pace through the midsection, is in P4. Karthik Mateti and uh, Arvind Ganesh are having a dance together at the moment, trying to get ahead of each other. Has Karthik Mateti shaken Arvind Ganesh off, or will the championship leader get ahead of number 12? Anandar on the GP helmet, a little bit fright from uh, Anand's bike. He's been pushing the pace there. Phew! This is the last lap and that could have proven disastrous for Anand. That was a big, big scare for Anand. He was losing a bit of traction from the front and check out flag of H, P1. Podium for Anand R who wins uh, the TBS one make RR with P2. For number seven, Vivek Pillai and P3, Anup Kumar, take a bow, you've done it again. With uh, P4, number six, Arun Muthu Krishnan. In P5, number 12, Kartik Mateti. In P6, our championship leader, number four, Arun Ganesh. In P7, number 14, Alameen Merchant. There's a change in order in P7. That's number 10, Ajay Xavier. Fabulous racing. Masterclass racing from all of them. Anandar from start to finish. Pole to P1. Take a bow, my friend. You came, you said, you will, and you did. Vivek Pillai. Managed to secure yet another second, and I'm sure he's going to be quite happy with that finish. Anup Kumar there in P3. Fabulous racing, gave out a blistering lap and managed to keep it together. We're going to go down to the checkered post while I catch up with the front runners, the winners of this race. 
Catch the replay where you can see clearly Anandar losing out the front there, managed to keep it safe and keep it together just with two corners to go. Fabulous racing from all of them. Let's go hear what they have to say. I'm sure Anandar is going to be ecstatic. I want to share his, his enthusiasm and his happiness with uh, all of y'all. So stay tuned. The sun setting into the horizon here at the Madras Motorsport Racetrack. Absolutely flying of a race from the TVS Apache RR 310 Open category, boys. We have the race winners here. Let's uh, take a quick chat with uh, Anup, who finishes in P3, bike number three, finishing in P3. Anup, you flew in between, you lost out in between. What is going on? Uh, uh, the bike uh, was a little bit different from yesterday, but uh, I think there were a few problems before the start of the race. But thanks to the TVS pit crew, they fixed it up quite fast. But uh, I also made a mistake in the first lap. Hope so, I don't do the same again next round. Well, you had an absolutely one flying lap. You were four seconds faster than the race leader himself. You were 154. What happened then? But I tried uh, uh, my best, but uh, bike kept on sliding everywhere. And yeah, this is... Managed to bring it back home, one piece. Well, that's the most important thing. You've got points. So that's Anup finishing in P3 for his second race.